former Milwaukee Public Schools teacher, uh, teacher's aide is suing the district now, saying he was not properly trained to deal with violent students. Jasmine Penix was fired a few days after video surfaced of him pushing a student to the floor. Pete Cervankis is live with more on what's in the lawsuit. Pete. Well, Vince, in that lawsuit, Penix alleges racial and gender discrimination. He accuses the district of failing to fire other employees who were female or of different races for similar incidents. Penix also says MPS didn't warn him about violent conditions at Bayview High School, where he worked as a teacher's aide, and he says he was never trained to deal with violent students. That's why he's now suing MPS for an unspecified amount in damages. Last April, you may recall a video showed Penix shoving a 14-year-old boy, then grabbing him by the neck and pushing him to the floor. He was fired a few days later, charged with misdemeanor battery. Eventually, he pleaded no contest and was found guilty last summer. Penix served three days in prison. But he maintains in this lawsuit, there's more to the story. He says the student in that video had assaulted him several times before the day the video was captured. He also alleges that a group of students, quote, orchestrated the incident specifically to try and get him fired. As for MPS, the district says it does not comment on any pending litigation. In Milwaukee, Pete Servakis, today's TMJ4.